Hi guys, welcome back to AC Technical. Today we are going to guide you through the process of cloning your Windows installation from an HDD to an SSD using a free and best disk cloning utility. This can significantly boost your system speed and performance. So let's get started. Before we begin, ensure you have installed Haslio Disk Clone on your computer. You can find the download link in the video description. Ok, now connect your SSD to your computer, either through a USB enclosure or directly to an available setup port. Once done, open the Haslio Disk Clone on your computer. If you don't have installed yet, you can download it from the official website. Find the link in the description below. Ok, as you can see, its graphical user interface just look like this. Now click on Clone option. Now choose the source drive where your current Windows installation on the HDD. Once done, then click on next. Now select your target drive, which is your new SSD where you want to clone your windows. Once done, then click on next. Review the cloning options. Like Haslio Disk Clone may offer specific settings for SSD optimization. Ensure your SSD has enough space for the clone. Once you have configured the settings, start the cloning process. Follow any on-screen prompts or warning message that may appear on your screen. Now take a break as the clone process runs. The duration depends on the size of your data. So keep patience. After cloning is completed, let me show you the disk layout from Windows Disk Management. Ok, as you can see, this is the target drive where I have cloned the windows. After cloning is completed, shut down your computer, which is highly recommended. Now physically replace the old HDD with the new SSD. Now turn on your computer. Enter the computer BIOS or UEFI settings. And set the SSD as the first root device. This ensures Windows boots up from the new SSD. Ok, once done, save configuration changes and exit from the BIOS. And check that Windows successfully boots from the SSD and that all your files and applications are intact. Note, if your SSD is larger than the HDD, consider expanding the partition to utilize the additional space. And lastly, check for update drivers and firmware updates, especially for new SSD. This ensures your system runs smoothly with the new hardware. Ok, now you have successfully cloned your Windows from your HDD to your SSD. So, I hope this guide was helpful for you. If you have any question or any advanced guide, then please let us know. 
please like comment and share we need your support and guys please don't forget to subscribe our channel thank you thanks for watching have a nice day